This video shows us what women expect from their boyfriends in relationships. Okay. This couple had only been dating for four months oh. when his girlfriend suffered a C5 spinal cord injury, oh. meaning paralysis in all four of her limbs. But this dude went beyond chivalry and stayed with her all the way to the end. The entire time she was in the hospital until she was ready to leave. Even at one point, she had told him he doesn't need to stay for her anymore. I'm gonna lie for you. If you're dating a woman and that happened to her, she said, oh, you don't need to stay? But I'm a dead leave, bro. Huh? I am sorry, but if you tell me I don't need to stay, I don't care what people think about me. I'm a leave. Wait, do you still have sex with her while she paralyzed? Do y'all do that? But that only made him stay for her even harder. Okay. Eventually, once she left the hospital, he went to the same school as her so he could continue caring for her. Huh. He made it through college as a couple, through the good times and the tough times. And then they graduated in 2018 and moved in together. Dope. So that means they were together during the pandemic, which we all know is really tough. They eventually got a house, nice. some puppies, hey. and then proposed to her. This dude is the definition of till death do us part. And for some reason, you can't seem to text back. But what do you guys think about that? Hey boy, what am I in my business for? If I don't feel like texting back, I'm not gonna do it. Stop harassing my soul. Make me think about that shit there right now. Oh yeah, that man is the real deal, bro. How the hell? I, I I don't think I could make it. I'm not mentally strong enough for this. I I I I I. I guess I am the fucked up individual. Cause I know for a fact I wouldn't stay. I would not have. That is bad. But whatever. You can't beat me. What I just see. Hey, why? Why you do that for? Is no one that women afraid of us? But not us. Y'all, I don't know nobody that's scared of me. So one thing about me is I don't really drink anymore. Um, and I'm not opposed to people drinking. If you want to drink, you're a grown adult. Did they? <laughs> I'll do that, but ladies, be careful. I don't know if this video is satire, but I've seen people before, especially sometimes men that do inappropriate things at bars, and I just find it very disgusting. Yeah, all right. Let me just say this, bro. If y'all going out drinking, and you know you want to get wasted, and you know, like, from the jump, you don't want to go home with no man, you're just going out and have fun and stuff, get you a fat fucking friend, an obese one. Because if they don't get in the attention, they go try to take the attention away from you. You get what I'm saying? Them girl and them hit not getting attention. So, gonna keep you if you're gonna take a load, a big load, just go and get yourself a fat friend. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I miss? I'm gonna tell you what I miss. I miss going to the car wash with my dad. Um, and it was usually like on a Saturday. And seeing all of the men out there washing their wives and their girlfriends' cars. She is pretty. What the hell? Yeah. Getting ready for the weekend. Um, I miss seeing that. Okay. I just finished washing my car, uh -huh. cleaning it out, yeah. and this whole car wash is full of women. Where are the men that takes the cars out for the weekly maintenance? What the hell? Bro, you just said it. All the women and them you're seeing in that car wash don't have a man. They don't have a husband. Just like you. You don't have one. You want them where them men and them do. Where your man do. Just how you don't have, they don't have. You get what I'm saying? So get one if you want the man and them to take your car to the car wash. Come on, man. You said it in the video. The husbands does go and wash the cars, you know? So if you don't have a husband who's going to wash the car, you're going to conjure up one in a book or you're going to be a witch and stir up one or... Who is this woman? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. It look like it might stress me out. Like washing the car, changing the oil, keeping gas Get a man. in my car Get because a man. I will forget. Get a man. Um. Yeah, I miss that. So get a man. If you miss seeing that, then make it happen. Get a boy in the comment section. I wash your car. I don't fuck all day, but she don't even like your comment. You don't feel stupid. Let me see she. Let me check out. Huh? What player bill is that? Turn this way. Turn, 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 turn. Turn now. Nah. I want to see the belly to ass ratio. Okay, let me go. Change my mind. Well, what do you Friends with benefits? What's the benefit of dating a man? Intimacy? Yeah. 
<laughs> hey, my mom pilot. Only man you does date. You don't like girls. Why are you talking about? <laughs> Lasting for two minutes isn't intimate, okay? It's essentially him doing a drive-by. <clears throat> no. It's absolutely disgusting, the hate that comes out of this guy's fucking mouth. You sit there and bash men on your page every fucking day, and you forget one key factor. You, sir, are a man. You're not a woman, okay? You pander to lonely, insecure women on the internet. You're in a full-blown relationship with a man, yet you're sitting there saying how they do drive-bys, how there's no intimacy. You talking about his man? That is gross. I hate happiness. Yo, I don't see the point of approaching women or bagging women. There's no point unless you know. The only way you get her is if you already know she's into you. Uh, what? But there's a lot of things wrong with this. Why are you free? Do you get shame? I know they'll say, oh, the worst she could say is no. Nah, she could record you. She could slander you. She could give you all kind of talk. She could shame you up and all kind of thing. It could make you feel real bad. It could make you feel low and whatever. But bro, we are men. We could take this. If you see a woman you like her, you never know, bro. She might just be your soulmate. And she was probably looking at you as well. But you didn't see. Like, you didn't notice. You're going to talk to her. Look, you have your woman. And you wanted her so bad. She probably wants you more. But you missed the opportunity because you want to be it. Nah, 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 nah. If I see a woman I like her going for, if I want you, I'm going to go for you. Yeah. Ladies, if a man can go all day without texting you, he doesn't want you. And I'm... Bro, oh, 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 is your problem? Is a boy and a problem? How do you know that? Go and see her probably text her. She take a long time to text back. So I taking a longer time to text back. I am very petty. I don't mean I don't want her. I just petty. My my fucking business. Why that way? Um, and why are you coming and see it? On behalf of all ladies, we know. But here's a message to all the gentlemen. Why you know you if a know. woman can go all day without texting you, then there's even a greater man that's giving her the emotional affections that you can't seem to fulfill. Yeah, man, let you do that. If I can't fulfill it, then yeah, let you go somewhere else. That's not a big deal. But believe it or not, it's that out. would be the best case scenario. Because okay. if it's not another man distracting her, then she's that much more interested in her own life without you in it. Now imagine that. A woman that would rather be on the phone with her mom than to check in on you. She would rather read a book than your text. Oh, <laughs> wait, wait, it gets better. No, She'd no. rather pleasure herself. Knowing she will hit the spot every single fucking time. I don't know what it is. You song like one of them kind of sim boys and them mother try to talk to them woman and them. Like, you know, oh, you need a real man to do this and blah, 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 whatever, nigga. I'm uh, dealing with a man. What should a woman bring to the table? Baby, when a woman is dealing with a man, a man allows that woman to understand that she is the table. Oh, he's one of those. Baby! He sung like them. All this stuff I don't want to talk about it, bro. I don't care. But um, that's something women are supposed to be having before they even get into a relationship. They're supposed to be loving their own company. They're supposed to be talking to their mother anyways. Because if you're not good with your mother, bro, I... Me don't want you. If you're not good with your father, me don't want you. You're supposed to be family oriented. Have a good relationship with your mother, your father, your brothers. Otherwise, I don't want that nothing to do with you in the first place. And yes, let she do something. If she wants to pleasure herself, that's fine. She don't go and get it from my next man. Who cares? I do Derek Jackson, light skin, Asian, whatever you is. Tell me, what do you want me to call you? What do you want to call me? I want to call you mine. Ooh. The cringe, bro. What the hell? How dare you? What in the prepubescent f is growing on your top lip? Did those hairs get lost trying to find your balls? <laughs> Probably not. Something tells me that's all the hair you've got nose down, dude. I've seen your mom spit out more pubes than you've got up there. Looking like an underage pedophile. Bro found that stash on clearance, but still only took half of it. Are you done? No! Your mustache literally looks like the shadow a mustache gives off. Kids at rock bottom, but my best advice is to shave. Got me doubting my religion. No amount of prayer is gonna fix that. Dude got a hair for every kid he shot in chemistry. We could chalk this up as a discrepancy. Homie's been diagnosed. With what? Mustache burgers race out the window. Hitler sees that you're cooked. Michael Finnegan finna get fucked by a dude looking ass. The least attractive women won't bother you. That stash got you looking. Post transition, you should have left that in the closet. There's not a community out there that will accept that. No way that's allowed on school property. What's that hair short for anyway? Heroin abuse? Jesus. Uh, Jesus has nothing to do with it. Um, shut up. Look, therapy is where this ends, kids, but trust me. Keep your chin tucked and your face hidden, and we'll pray the gay away together. <laughs> 
Whoever that guy holding the camera is, I don't want to meet a man in person ever. I have talk. I could give talk. I am very quick with it. But I, I, I don't want that kind of drama. Nah, no thanks. You could...